Next, we're going to talk about the tibial motor study. The tibial motor nerve can involve in a condition we call tarsal tunnel syndrome. And tarsal tunnel is a compression of the tibial nerve at the ankle. Usually, it follows foot injury and sprained ankles. Tarsal tunnel can cause a lot of pain in the foot and ankle and burning sensation in the sole of the foot. And usually, the treatment consists of decompression of the tibial nerve at the ankle. And the next nerve that we're going to do is going to be the tibial nerve. And I press next. And now you're going to see the tibial nerve pop up here. And here we stimulate the tibial nerve at the ankle. And right behind the ankle, as a matter of fact. And here's where we put the electrode. We put the black right below the bone right here, the foot bone. And we put the red electrode right on the bone itself. So here we go. I'm going to take the electrodes from where they were here. And this is where the abductor halysis muscle is. That's, we call it abductor halysis or AH. OK. And then we're going to put the red electrode. We're going to put it right here on the bone itself. And we're going to measure the distance from here to behind the ankle. And it should be 14 centimeters. And here's the ruler. And it shows that the tibial motor here is 14 centimeters. So I'm going to do it this way and that way. And I take the marker, and I put the marker right in that hole. And so that's where I will stimulate the tibial nerve. Here we go. And the tibial nerve flexes the foot forward like this, and of course the toes forward. So as soon as I start stimulating, you're going to you should see the toes flexing forward. Here we go. I'm increasing the stimulus. And we got a very nice response right away. Still building up. Here we go. And I accept that. And basically, that's the tibial, ner tibial nerve, the tibial motor. Here we go. So the next study we're going to do is the tibial F wave. And all I got to do is press next on the machine. And we're going to get the F wave, which I stimulate right in the same place as I stimulated the tibial nerve. And I go up. I think I got it high enough. So I go up here on the stimulus intensity. And I'm going to start stimulating. And now I got it. And you see the beginning of the F wave here, right there. Here's the F wave. So I accept that. Now that's the next one. And that's a wonderful F wave. You don't get them like this too, too frequently. So I accept that. And here's a nice, another nice one. Also, it's wonderful. I accept that. Here's another one. And I noticed I didn't have to ask her to make a fist here. So she had very good F waves in this muscle, and I accept that. And now we're done with the F wave, and now the screen is going to show you the minimum F wave, the maximum, and the mean F wave. And that's the end of the study for the tibial F wave.